What's up? What's good? What's the problem? Cracks percolate. What's really good in the hood? It's your man Theo Butler. And first of all, I miss y'all. I miss y'all. No, I miss y'all. Yesterday was my birthday, so I started to celebrate my birthday on April 20th. Yesterday being my birthday, 53 years old. So I'm glad to be here another year. Glad to be here. Um, before we begin, I want to thank y'all for rocking with me. Um, those of y'all who've been hitting me up in my comment section and everything like that, y'all really been letting me know which direction I should take this channel for the most part. So I want to thank y'all for that. Um, be sure to click that subscribe button, share, like, make sure you hit the notification bell. That way you get the comments, you get my uh, videos when I upload them. <clears throat> this video today is about diversity in comics and getting it right because the same arguments that we make for how we got characters wrong in the 60s regardless of what our intent was you know we, we got some names wrong we got some um some characterizations wrong uh same way we're getting wrong with with members of the lgbtq and i was just talking to my wife about it and i said you know what i got i gotta speak on it i gotta speak on it so as you know by now i'm a veteran and one of the things that's bothered me is how looking at many of the of, of the comments in social media looking at many of the reviews uh youtubers who are making the comments in regards to john walker i gotta throw a flag on the play <clears throat> Just like how we've gotten certain characterizations wrong in the past because we've been speaking from a place of ignorance, even though we mean well, we speak from a place of ignorance. Uh, in regards to how we try to, let's look at Falcon and the Winter Soldier, comic books, John Walker, when he became Captain America, how we made Lamar Hoskins Bucky. We meant well, but we got it wrong because we didn't know any better. The the editors, the writers, they meant well. They wanted to make a black sidekick to John Walker, but Lamar Hoskins was a grown man. The term buck was derogatory for African Americans. The editors and the writers didn't know because we weren't the editors nor the writers. But Theo, how does this relate to John Walker? Because they've been saying, exactly. If we go back through the episodes of Falcon and the Winter Soldier, and we look at the conversations that Lamar Hoskins and John Walker had, Lamar Hoskins was over there in Afghanistan with John Walker. When they talked, John said, we did some terrible things over there. We. If we look at what took place during the Falcon and the Winter Soldier, you know who suffered the worst ass whoopings out of the two men? John Walker and Lamar Hoskins it wasn't John Walker it was Lamar Hoskins the very first episode that he was in in which he was fighting he got kicked off a truck he picked himself up he got into it with the door Melage. he got his ass handed to him he picked himself up He took on the Flag Smashers, he got knocked out and tied up. He had an honest conversation with his friend the night before. He said the Super Soldier Serum just makes you more of who you are. The same people that do these videos, these YouTube videos, you never say at one time that Lamar Hoskins suffered from PTSD. Why? If John Walker suffered from PTSD, so did Lamar Hoskins. They were both there. 
what John Walker did, that's don't blame that on PTSD. Not if you're not going to give that same thing, that same benefit of the doubt to Lamar Hoskins. But if you're not going to mention it in regards to Lamar Hoskins, knowing that they both served in Afghanistan, that they're both wartime service members, don't bring that up because you're speaking from a place of ignorance. If you want to speak about PTSD and you want to do these videos, these YouTube videos in regards to comic book characters, speak to a veteran person. I'm a writer. If I want to write about a woman, if I want to write about a member of the LGBTQ, if I want to write about a member of the Asian community, if I want to write about a law enforcement officer, See, I can mean well at the end of the day. But that just means I mean well. But I have to also understand my ignorance involved in writing. If I'm ignorant about a thing or a person, I got to get my knowledge up. And sometimes that knowledge doesn't just consist of picking up a book. Sometimes that knowledge consists of me actually speaking to somebody, listening to them, and maybe, just maybe, letting them write this from their perspective. And then bringing their words over into mine. I ain't saying, I'm just saying. That's my time. Hey, listen, Falcon, the Winter Soldier, they dropping. Episode 6 is dropping 3 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Y'all make sure y'all go get that. Also, Riri Williams, the action figure, the Ironheart action figure, her Mark I armor. Yes, that is on pre-sale right now at Hasbro. Also, Hasbro Pulse. Y'all go get that. Also, I'm able to say that I just copped two more Dora, Dora Milaje. Y'all think y'all slick. I see what y'all was doing. The Dora Milaje they got some shine, Falcon and the Winter Soldier, and you scalpers hiked them prices up. I see what y'all did. Shout out to my dog who was only who didn't do that. You didn't do that, bro. You didn't do that. I got two of them from you. I appreciate you keeping that thing 100. But y'all stop with that. Y'all and y'all called the Dora Milaje peg warmers. Ooh, <laughs> and then y'all go jack the price up on eBay. Y'all not slick. Listen, go get them action figures. Oh, Lady Beetle. Is a sister. Y'all get her. Also, I don't know if y'all know this. Tombstone is a brother as well. Y'all go get that. So if y'all collect the African American action figures, y'all go ahead and do that. Also, if y'all got what the dude named Wrecking Ball, y'all drop that price. Ain't nobody buying that. I don't Wrecking Ball, Wrecking Ball and Shaman. Nobody is doing that. We'll send out a message to Hasbro to get them characters, get them action figures remade. Ain't nobody doing that. I ain't saying I'm just saying. Peace.